Welcome back to Reactions Unlimited. And today we are in the capital, the District of Columbia with the beautiful, what is the name of the Rangi. prince? Rangi. Rangi. So cute. But He's a little back. baby. I know, right? Who's a little baby? And I can't wait for Rangi to watch BTS. BTS. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Are you my little black <laughs> swan? Are you my little <laughs> black swan? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> but welcome not. back. I Thank am you. so glad you're back, back, back because they are waiting for you. No. Who are they? The viewers. I like that you're like, no, and I'm like, oh, they were. <laughs> My own mother doesn't wait for me. <laughs> she just leaves. But they are. They love to see you both because I don't know if you've watched BTS with this reaction. I don't think you've done a mm -hmm. reaction yet, right? But no. you. We watched BTS in sync, and exactly. they were like more in sync than we are. Like <laughs> more in sync than in sync? American group? Wow, fun. Sure. Wasn't that fun? <laughs> that, was, that was a good one. It's fun. <laughs> <laughs> Just acknowledgement. It's fun. <laughs> but yeah, so it's. I'm glad that both of you are here and we're here in D.C. We're here in D.C. now, but Julian and I actually know each other from Korea. Mm -hmm. We've been in Korea back in 2018, and let's right. just talk about what BTS was like living in Korea, because I feel like a oh. lot of K-pop fans, especially BTS fans here, right. never really get to experience what it's like living in the country where your artist is from. Yeah. They're everywhere. I, well, at the time, like... In the, 2018. In 2018, yes, they were literally everywhere on every single store. You couldn't walk through Shincheon without seeing their faces on literally every store. Because Shincheon is like a college university town, so it's like their main demographic, too, mm -hmm. of like yep. college kids. Mm -hmm. um, and then there's also this whole like street performance culture in oh a neighboring God. town, in Hongdae. Hongdae. And like all of them just like, they used to re like do a lot of dances by all the mm -hmm. groups, and then it was just like, we only dance to BTS yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, oh, wow. yeah. Question, what's the most played song that you've heard so far when you were in Korea. Of DNA, BTS. probably. Yeah, DNA. yeah was, DNA. I love DNA too. Yeah, but that's because like it cycles through, so they don't usually play the older songs. But right. then like, it's the same thing here of like you'll go into a store or something and you'll be like, ooh, whoever's got the like iPhone jack, like they've got good music taste. So mm. it's the same thing in Korea of like someone mm. in the store is going to be playing the music. But it's always like K-pop, so sometimes you'll just hear like an old like 2014 BTS song and you'll be like, oh. Oh, are you talking about here in America? No, they're in Korea. I never hear old music in Korea. Only in like the little mom and pop shops when you know that they have the iPhone jack. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, like yeah, the yeah, yeah. And the, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, the reason why I've, <laughs> the reason why I've asked is because I have a new favorite song. Okay. It was, it was just released, and they I've reacted to it, guys. If you wanted to watch that, it's also in on the, the description. Yes, and also it's in the playlist. For BTS, Ooh, just all the BTS videos. Just go. Yeah, I haven't out. heard the song yet either. So Black Swan. Yeah, I haven't heard it okay. either. So I've heard of this twice already. One is when it was performed by the dance company, um, and now they did their first ever live performance of the song. And I've watched it, guys, as you may have noticed. But I wanted to show it to you because this is really good. Like I can tell my favorite so far okay okay i'm excited to hear That's it. A, those are pretty high expectations i know right i set yeah. the bar high, you set the bar high. <laughs> <laughs> it's because it's bts okay. okay all right so let's see what the boys have going on yes oh it's all like watery how beautiful oh swan lake we got some good traditional Ooh, they are clean. Yeah. They're barefoot. They are. You don't They got that. no shoes on. Well, I hope they don't slip. Like they would. <laughs> I like how they're taking other members off stage mm -hmm. and really showcasing just individual talent as well. He got so handsome. He did get very handsome. Glow up of the decade. Look at V. You like V. I do like V. He's such a pretty boy. Oh, Jimin. Jimin. Oh, Jimin is hot as hell. What? Okay. okay. 
that that move, you know it's gonna be a TikTok trend. Oh, for sure. They're very fluid. Oh, Jin. Oh. I love that footwork. The stage direction, like the lighting. Like, it complements the performance so well. It really does look like they're dancing on glass. Almost. Yeah, it's literally not just a performance. It's, like, almost art. I think it is art. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I, you know, I, I always see them really trying their best to be to make sure that it, they incorporate the art on it. Like, mm -hmm. every time I see them, there's always an art. Like, I like the fact that they, st I saw, I mentioned that in my reaction, that I like the fact that they were starting it with their hands. Mm -hmm. With a very contemporary style dance, yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, there's this thing in Korea where there's a separation between people who are artists and pop artists, yeah. right? And yeah. it's like, there's different words for it, like, and on TV shows, that's like a big compliment that mm -hmm. they'll give someone is like, oh, like, you're a real artist. Like, you're right. not just a K-pop idol. You're a real artist. And, like, BTS really attained that early on. Mm -hmm. And they kept, like, snowballing with it. Like, it's never stopped improving, you know? I love that term. That's a good term. It Snowball. Really, it's a good term for <laughs> It is. <laughs> it's a good term. <laughs> I mean, what was, like... This is different than what I expect from them. Oh, Just no, they... off of when I kind of tapered off listening to K-pop, like it, when I moved to Korea, it's just everywhere, so I wasn't like yeah, no. looking for it as much. And like I feel like this is a very different style than what I remember them having. A hundred percent. Like when they first started and they were nobodies in Korea, like they when we were living in Korea, we'd been there since like the first time I was twenty sixteen. Yeah. Like they, And they were big in the US, but they weren't they, super they were big not, in Korea. They at were the time. not heard of in Korea, but um then which what was it the VH1 performance? Mm -hmm. They like blew up. Korea was like, yes, thank you. Okay, we love you too. But like, this is a very different BTS. Like, there's you can see the growth from it. So yeah. It's, yeah, I mean, if I'm just thinking about like, I remember when they debuted in 2013, and they were auto they started gaining such a following in the U.S., but like not as much of a following in Korea, especially when we were mm -hmm. there. And now you can just see that kind of the support of their home team, like having the sport in yeah. Korea, I feel like that's a lot of what's catapulted them oh, to yeah. being this level of artistry is like, yes, we're popular everywhere else, but we also have that love coming from our home. It's you know? like, Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad you're liking it. Let's see the rest because I already watched it, but several times. So now times. you're just watching us. Exactly. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm just okay. watching you because I've watched it several times after I've watched the reaction. I was like, I needed to go back, but okay. let's see this uh, yeah. the next. One. More art, please. Ooh, that core strength, that balance for oh that leg lift. That was beautiful. Oh, I love that. I love that interaction between members. It's really going to fuel the fan fiction. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I think that's from Swan Lake. That dipping right, down I like burns. So. That re wow. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah. You noticed that as well. Like mm -hmm. when I reacted, I know I said in my reaction that it looked like they were entering as if they were swans. Yeah. yeah like literally swans. Like so I love Got that. Got Natalie Portman in here. <laughs> what was that move? Which one, sorry? They were like oh, lifting up on their hands and you then their butt was going that as back well. and forth. Did you see that? Julie? Wait, I'm focused on his lips right now. There's well, so we much. Can... <laughs> <laughs> That's who I am. He looks so good. So okay. that is. They're that, like lifted up on their hands and then they were like scooting. <laughs> Scooting. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I love that. If you notice that, we're on the same page. It's like... I literally <laughs> mentioned that on my reaction, saying that is my favorite okay. ever choreo because 
I've never seen such a thing. But we can. It looks it. like you know when you were in gym class and they had the little scooters. Yeah, and you would it, accidentally crush your fingers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It looks like they were on those, but they weren't there. <laughs> you guys are on the same page, and I'm not even on the same book. Like, oh. I, mean, <laughs> I want to get on your level. Okay, just <laughs> you're too focused on the face. Yeah. <laughs> I know, right? Julian's just out here being like, "What skincare are they using? <laughs> Who's their doctor? Which doctor, Kim?" <laughs> But you're funny. Just like, do I just go to Shinsa Dong? Like, but yeah, let's see. Okay. If you know it. There you go, that one. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. That's you so ever seen that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. I could never. So fluid. They are killing us. Oh. I hope it's a nice funeral. This is a really high production value yeah. to bring to the late, late show with James Corden. Yeah, I was thinking because, like, usually when Korean artists it, come to America to perform. When any artist performs on a late show, it's just, like, a stage. A stage, but, like, they got this, the full treatment. They brought treatment. the full M-net treatment. Yeah, like, they deserve it. So, like, kudos, James Corden. Ooh. That's so good. I wonder what the... So, their hand pose is going up like that. Mm -hmm. I haven't looked at the lyrics yet, but doesn't it look a little bit like a shotgun like shooting birds out of the sky? Well, I would hate that. Hunting is mean. Hunting is mean, but like, it's Black Swan, like... Okay. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it, it, it. they started, I said well, in my reaction, they started like this and they ended it like that. I oh. love that. Little birds flying free. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, let's do a recap. I already okay. did my reaction, but here, I wanted to... Let me look to... up some of the lyrics, too. Yeah. I'm sweating. Oh, you finally took off your, like aesthetic jacket okay well when you're like reviewing at bts there's a certain standard <laughs> <laughs> my so you're, not you're, up to snuff you're trying to get to the standard okay i'm joking i can't talk <laughs> <laughs> i mean like just in recapping it felt are you getting the baby i'm getting the baby you're getting the baby <laughs> what did you think what did you think of bts yeah. He doesn't have any thoughts. He literally can't remember, like, what Yesterday. his name is. Yeah. Um, I mean, the choreography, I expected a lot because it's BTS. You right. expect a lot from them, you know? Right. And it's not to say I'm not impressed, but it's to say that they delivered on my expectation of what I've come to expect in terms of the standard of quality from their choreography and from their execution of it. It's sharp and fluid at the same time. Absolutely. It's completely in sync. It's totally effortless looking but you know that behind that it's taken weeks of preparation yeah. you know yeah no you could see like you actually just couldn't see it was the fun thing like the focus like yeah. it wasn't like they had to try it's just already like born into them like from their hard work mm -hmm. it was just a flawless execution and it just looked cool because it didn't look like they were trying so hard it was just so seamlessly cool mm -hmm. yeah yeah well that is Black Swan, and they are releasing their album soon, like Ooh. Feb. I, I've heard, like Feb in Feb. February. Yeah, okay. This Feb, yeah. And this I can't Feb. wait. Yeah, there's Ego that's coming up soon, which I will be watching over. Too. Ooh, okay. Okay. I mean, have I'd love to see a music video for this because BTS is known for their like super artsy. Yeah, they their music videos are like candy. It's just yeah, you just keep. Yeah, you, you one you can't stop at one. No. You gotta keep. It. And then you like go back three years and you're like, does it tie in? <laughs> <laughs> are they connected? <laughs> is there an yeah. arc? <laughs> there was definitely like when I was in undergrad. There was yeah. definitely like an all nighter spent with me being like, how and no, they're all connected. I can. Feel it in my bones. Yeah. Well, I've watched this storyline, but I, you know, I haven't finished it because I'm also having a hard time because I'm a baby army. I'm, Aww, I'm trying who's to. Who's a little baby army? Yeah, I'm trying. What an odd image. <laughs> <laughs> army of babies. Yeah. 
babies. Or... <laughs> no, I was no, no. <laughs> sure. <laughs> a few months old, baby army. That's what I call myself. Okay. Because so you can I... support your head, but like you're not thinking yet. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you're still top heavy. Top <laughs> heavy. <laughs> but yes, it's a. Uh, it's something where I'm new, uh-huh. so I'm trying to learn, but I have to catch up with a lot of videos. Well, you, they've got to tell us what videos we should be reacting yes, to. Yes, that's awesome. Yeah. So, you guys, obviously, we've loved BTS for a while. We love watching them. We love appreciating their talent and artwork. Appreciating their growth, their development. Uh, their, honestly, their growth and development is just, yeah. like, unparalleled in this industry. Yeah. They look mature in this one. They, when you compare it to the first few videos oh yeah oh like, uh, well definitely. when you look at they were babies baby yes. Jimin? Oh. <laughs> oh, <yeah>. <laughs> with all that fucking coal eyeliner oh, yeah. you remember they were real heavy eyeliner they, they, got they were real eye, grungy yeah I, I was into it, it was <laughs> but they all look good like i was looking at them i was like yeah that's not a question no <laughs> they, like, arguing that. Question. they look yeah. great yeah i will say that sugar the platinum blonde sugar mm. Didn't think I'd like it. Didn't think I'd like him platinum mm-hmm. blonde. Loved it. I yes. I was at peace with it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I, I I it's a good look on him. I preferred other hair colors on him. I loved the mint. The mint was adorable. The mint green was just like what? It was because because he's so like tough, but then he's shaka. got the aesthetic of just like bounce. Yeah. You know? So I, I like a little bit of color on him because I think it just really suits his it personality. Well. I think that Ratmon or RM, sorry, real me now, yeah. Rip Ratmon, <laughs> rest in peace. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's real. He's been me. reborn. Yeah. Um, I think he's really found his look. He, yeah. he, he, he literally like the years were very kind to him. His cheekbones. Yeah. His cheekbones, but then also just the hair. You remember his debut hair with the, the, the yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's he's come a long way. Yeah. I think he could stay with this style and aesthetic through his career. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah this is an ageless, timeless aesthetic. No, for me, I like this hair here. here. I really? Like, I like the one where... It's, That's an opinion. Yeah. I, it's, I think Closing. it's a little too long because he's got such a, yeah. hand, he's got such a handsome face. It's just hiding face. his face. And it's such a good we face. We sound like our mothers. Yes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like, my God. Why can't you just cut your hair? You no got- one can see your face. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a pretty <laughs> boy. <laughs> Why are you hiding your face? Yeah, I think they should cut it just a bit. Or, or maybe we're just the... getting old. No, I think he's a beautiful boy. And to hide the face is just like, I guess it's kind of like a like a peak. You're like, ooh, I want more, I want more. I just, just give me the more. Yeah. I don't like the two. I don't, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so to wrap up. <laughs> to wrap up. Yes. We could go on about this for like exactly. an hour or two. Well, there's a lot more videos we can watch related to their growth. Growth. And, okay. you know, like funny moments. And yeah. also like hairstyle and everything, fashion. But yes, we would love to hear from you guys. What would you like to for us to react? Yeah, to? let us know in the comments below. Um, I might sneak into the comments of this video. I my YouTube channel is not my name, so mm-hmm. you might not know it's me. But I'm lurking. <laughs> yes. Oh yeah, my YouTube channel is my name, and I've replied to you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's reply. You know? Yeah. Because I love that, you know, whenever I see them comment, I normally wanted to reply, but there's hundreds of them, but I try my best. Yeah. But let's so do that. Though. Okay. And can you tell them your Instagram? Just in yeah, yeah. So I'm at Emily underscore Remick, R-E-M-I-C-K. And I'm at Julian Bielusch, and that's awful to spell, so that'll be written down below. But go ahead and follow us. I love interacting with interacting you guys with you guys it's you've really been sending fun. me some videos some comments on my pictures and it's just so fun you'd like you, angela you have a really great community yeah they are very very a lively community they tell me everything i don't know we just yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> i was reading um the mama moo comments and i'm like yeah i messed that up yeah and they're just like she was really nice but she just needs to know and i'm like exactly. i've learned i've learned i've grown and applied right. <laughs> yes. all right all right, guys. Ooh. Well, thank you so much for tuning with us. We love to hear from you. Comment below. And until next time. Dame pota. Oh, dame paya.